destruction of the dermatological How we get it? There are different ways of the transmission, like directly, when you touch the sick human or animal directly, or indirectly, when you touch various objects or things that the sick human or the sick animal touched before. Some fungus disease prevail among children of the kindergarten age and school children. Others are prevalent among adults. Some fungus diseases are characterized by the mass seasonal infection and seasonal character of the exacerbation of the process. The climate and soil conditions of the given locally have an effect on the spring of the dermatomycosis. There are different forms of the mycosis. For this reason, we have the classification. First, keratomycosis. Second, dermatomycosis. Third, candidiasis. Fourth, deep systemic mycosis. And the last one, pseudomycosis. We will talk about keratomycosis. It is located in the epidermis of the skin, in the horny layer, extractum corneum. For this reason, it is also called superficial disease. It is very low contagiosity. Have the answers of the pronounced inflammatory phenomena, no inflammatory process. It is subdivided into different forms. Picteriasis versicolor, trichosporosis nodosa, and trichomycosis axillaris. Bacteriasis versicolor is also called tinea versicolor. It is caused by a type of yeast that naturally lies on your skin, but when changes their environment, they can cause rashes. The causative agent is Pterosporum orbiculare or Malassezia faifuris. The risk factors of this disease is when you have oily skin, when you live in a hot weather, and when you have weak immune system, it can affect any race, any age, but more prominence in teenagers and in adults. It increases of sweating because change of the chemical composition of it, and it will lead to the disease. Signs and symptoms of the disease. It is a long duration, can be months and years. And sometimes you will feel like a meal itching. And the typical localization are the chest, the back, the neck, the higher part of the head, the abdomen, the sides of the trunk, and the lateral surface of the arm. You will see yellowish, brownish, pink spots and are not elevated above the skin surface with no inflammatory phenomena. This is important because it's not inflammatory phenomena. The clinical picture and course you will see the color of the spots gradually turns to the dark brown or sometimes to the cafe with milk. The color range severe as the basis for the name versicolor means that versicolor is the change gradually of the color of these spots. First yellowish, brownish, pink, and then you will see it more dark brown or more cafe with milk. How to diagnostic it? We have the burning sign, where is the scratching of the skin. The second is the Balner's iodine test, when the skin is painted with a 5% iodine tincture. In the affected areas with the lucid horny layer are staining more intensely than the healthy skin areas. The most famous method is the wound glass or the wound lamp. Is a special mercury lamp that emits ultraviolet light. It is used to examine the skin in a dark room. The lamp is turned on and held about 10 cm from the skin to look for color changes. In the case of the Picteriasis versicolor, you will see yellowish or greenish fluorescent spots. Will be seen in up to a third of the cases. Remember that the patient should not take a shower the day before of the, this exam. The last is the microscopy of a scale with 20 
till 30% of the potassium or sodium hydroxide solution. You need to press attention in the differential diagnosis because we have different dermatological process that will lead to different diseases. But when you see the patients like in Pteriasis versicolor, you can confuse with different diseases like vitiligo, lichen planus, seborrheic dermatitis, secondary syphilis, erythrasma, and mycosis fungoides. You need to be attended. Treatment. You can use topical antifungal, like 2 portion of ketonazole cream, and can be used usually daily for two weeks. Also can be used in shampoo form and it can be applied in the affected areas and left on for five minutes and then wash it. This application can be done for one to three days. You can use also saline sulfide, which is folates, the infected structure and corneum of the skin and applies for a week as a lotion for 10 minutes each day. Or also you can use oral treatments like itraconazole 200% daily for 5 days or glucoconazole 2 doses of 300 mg separated by 1 week. You cannot use these drugs usually because it can have side effects and you need to take care about your body. Prevention. You can use 2% of body acid salicylic or alcohol once a day for several weeks after the treatment has been completed and you can avoid the overheating and skin hygiene should be strictly observed. Thank you for your attention. Bye bye.